What's going on guys, Authentic Jays back again with another video. And this is officially episode 2 of my mini-series where I review and react to custom shoes that I find on Reddit. But before I start, quick shout out to the creative geniuses that I reviewed last week. I reached out to them and they showed me nothing but love and support. So quick shout out to them. These guys are something else. And if you guys didn't get a chance to check it out, make sure to check my last video. I'll put the link in the video and in the description below. Just want you guys to know that I do read every single comment. I did respond to every single one of these guys. Some even DM'd me on Reddit and also commented on my videos. So thank you guys so much for the support. You guys are the reason why I wanted to do episode two. So thank you guys so much. Overall, I just want to help other customizers out because I know the struggle as I am up and coming. I am brand new and can use all the shout outs and exposures as possible. Maybe some people will need it, maybe some won't, but I just want to give someone support. So let's just support each other and give each other good vibes because that's the whole point of this. And with that being said, let's head on over to Reddit. Welcome back guys. We're gonna start it off again. We're gonna go to custom sneakers And if you guys want me to review another subreddit, just let me know and I'll make sure to check them out That being said, we're gonna go to the top and then we're gonna go to this week Okay, first damn we're starting off strong. Oh my goodness First of all, I low-key love this type of art just the shadowing and everything and the marble look he did the whole lightning and everything. I really like the details and the shadowing that he put on this. And again, from my last video, I mentioned that it is very hard to put a lot of detail in something so small. And for him to capture all this depth and all the shadows and you see all the strokes, it's very clean, nice and blended out, looking smooth. But yo, painting these two levels, having this look so seamless, this is very hard to do. This is something to respect amazing job super clean the line work the strokes the blending the lightning effect man there's just so much detail in this shoe i am not surprised that he is number one for this week he hasn't even done the right shoe yet but i mean if it's anywhere close to something like this i know it's already gonna be a solid pair this was by noodle salat solid job noodle salat salat i'll get it right but Great job, man. Solid shoe. So creative. I love the lightning, man. The small details like that that make it. Okay, on to the next one. Holy. Oh, my God. Look at these. Oh, I don't even know where to start. Oh, my God. Wow. Oh, my God. Wow. I don't even know where to start because I love almost every part about this shoe. The fact that he has three different colorways, the Nike swoosh looks so legit, the attention to detail with the laces, the skull right here, and you got this little blood stain. It almost looks like, you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of those uh, wax on those envelopes, but damn. If you hate on this shoe, then you're just a hater. There's no way you can hate on this shoe. This just looks so clean. Even the finish on the fabric, super duper clean i can't believe how much detail was put into this i mean guys what can i say there's nothing to be said i think these are one of those shoes that speak for itself how much work how much dedication it took to put all three of these together oh my god every angle is so clean like this is something that looks like straight out of retail like they straight up collabed so this was made by our star 248 you definitely deserve this upvote i can't get over how clean this is amazing amazing job okay on to the next one here we go simpsons nike blazer 77 all right let's check this out this is so clean i don't know why but i did notice that the Simpsons is a very common custom. I really don't know why, but I see a lot of 
Bart Simpsons, a lot of Homer Simpsons, a lot of donuts and sprinkles like this. I guess just because it's so colorful and loud, but this is one of the better ones I've seen. I've definitely seen a lot, and this one right here looks so clean. I love how he kept the shape of the Nike swoosh and the fact that it looks like Homer's grabbing it. I mean, look at the shadows, man. Look at this. And I can see already that, you know, when they do the whole intro and then it shows like the clouds. I don't know what's on there. Does he have any other pictures? No, he does not. Okay. But I would love to see the different angles. I like how he didn't just stop at the leather. He went down to the sole and I would definitely, definitely rank this in the top simpson customs because this is not only creative but the attention to detail the line work the shadows the sprinkles the cloud solid job oh my god it's noodle salad again jeez man you are killing it this week great job man solid shoe i love the cleanliness of your designs okay Missing the beach, gotta catch them waves soon. I feel you, man. Now, I like this because one, what a creative way to customize the swoosh. This looks super clean. It looks very beach vibey. I mean, even got the dead fish over here. Look at these waves, man. I know a lot of customs have I think it's the great wave and a lot of people and I'll make sure to put a photo when I edit but there is this great wave custom that a lot of people do so it's a breath of fresh air when you see something unique like this his waves are clean I like the shadows I like the highlights I like how they're sporadically spiked out I even like how he customized the shoelace and I love, I love these small little characters, especially if it's all in here or here. It's just that extra detail, the cherry on top that you don't have to put, but it is there. And I like that. So great job. And this was done by Custom Zero Shoes. Great job, Custom Zero Shoes. You definitely deserve an upload. Oh wow, my first custom shoe, Nike Air Force One. YouTube video down below, please comment. I'm definitely gonna have to comment on this because Christian GBL, I love the look of fish. And again, remember what I was saying about the small logo with the cherry on top? This is exactly what I'm talking about. And even these little lines, man, I know it looks simple, but this is very tedious to do. And to keep it as uniform, all the heights are the same. These extra squiggles, he didn't have to add these squiggles. He did it because he knew that these small details are what really make a shoe. And I like how it just goes so well together. Definitely something I could see people rocking. Wow, so much detail. Look at the scales. Even on the black, he went over again with the scales, these spikes man even the tail fin i cannot believe how creative you guys are like i honestly cannot believe it okay wow looks even better in the sun look at how the colors just pop in the sun <laughs> look at his little mouth oh and on feet look at this man okay he got him on feet with matching socks you can tell that this guy cares this is a solid shoe and a solid custom this guy knows how to show off his shoes, and I respect that. Okay, even the orange autumn leaves. I think he's showing us all the occasions where he can wear this type of shoe, because, you know, it's very loud. Some people are just going to be like, when would I ever rock that? How would I rock that? What would I wear? Well, you can wear it in the fall. Look at these leaves. Look at how well it works together. You can wear it with these socks. Look at how clean they look. And in the sun, holy crap crap just so much color so vibrant definitely definitely a solid custom and you deserve an upvote christian gbl okay so it's around the 10 minute mark now so i'm probably gonna call it for this video 
but if you guys enjoyed this and had any questions make sure to comment down below so i know and if you guys enjoyed it make sure to like comment and subscribe if you're interested check out my other videos but until next time peace